I come from a family, actually, everybody's in the medical field, everybody's a scientist, and I don't know why I did it, but I actually hid my seizures. My name is Danielle. I live in Salt Lake City, Utah, and I have been living with epilepsy for 25 years. I actually had a pretty good idea of what they were at the time. My father's a pediatrician. I had been studying all his books since I was about five or six years old. And the only person who ever really noticed anything was my little sister. And I told her basically to be quiet about them. I got into a car accident my first year of college, didn't hit anybody or another car. I actually ran into a gas station. It just so happens that our insurance guy, he was a friend of the family and he had a grandson who had epilepsy and he was a little suspicious and had told my mother and father that he was suspicious about it. So that's when I said, I think I'm having seizures or something wrong. My seizures tended to cluster. So I'd go two or three weeks without having any seizures. And then I'd have a week where basically every day I'd be having 10 seizures or more. <clears throat> and it was getting to the point where I could function perfectly fine for two or three weeks. And then for that week, I'd be doing nothing but sleeping. And I work in the medical field where you can't just work for three weeks and then take a week off. My doctors and I had tried other things, um, basically every medication. And I had finally told my doctors that we had to try something else. Luckily for me, I come from an area where we have an excellent neurology center. My neurologist put me on the pathway to start doing the steps to go up to the RNS system. I had the RNS placed April of 2018, so I've had it just a little over a year. Since my physician has turned on my RNS system, I don't notice any symptoms, any seizures. I don't know that they're there. I almost wonder sometimes if I still have epilepsy, even though my physician tells me, yes, you still have epilepsy. I have five beautiful children and I have eight absolutely gorgeous grandchildren. One of the best things I have gotten since the RNS system is I don't constantly have my family asking me all the time if I'm okay. I think my older kids feel a little bit more comfortable leaving my grandkids with me <laughs> alone. <laughs> so I get to babysit more. <laughs> I would definitely do the RNS system again. I wish that they had the RNS system 25 years ago. <laughs> it's a wonderful, wonderful feeling.